What's good everyone? Twitch is back with another video. In this video, I'll be going through uh, making a faith build. Um, mostly just uh, where to get one of the most powerful faith spells, uh, miracles. Um, so I'll go with male. Cleric. Um, Gift of Master Key. Go Average. Mm. Hearted Center, I guess. And we'll go with Gold. Um, just because I can, and it's a Faith build. name her I uh, I mean him Jesus most of my faith builds end up being female so forgive me um, I'll name him I'll decide whether or not to actually make him a uh, Faith strength build later. But for now, we'll go with that. Um, I'm gonna skip this. If you really want to watch it, go watch uh, Weebius. Called Lord of Weebs vs. Dark Souls, um, part one. In fact, uh, Lord of Weebs vs. Dark Souls in general. The adventures of Weebius are going to have all cutscenes. No skipping whatsoever. So this is just your typical shit. Obviously, because I'm a cleric, I start with a spell, as do all magic casting um, classes. I start with heal, um, sorcerer starts with soul arrow, and pyromancer starts with fireball. So you can see um, the tutorial boss sitting pretty up there. I'll jump down once I get far enough into his domain. But I'm gonna come over here. Light this bonfire. I'm not gonna rest at it because I don't really see a point in resting at it. To be honest. Grab my shield. Grab my mace. This asshole. So after playing through Honor Londo, I don't like any archers whatsoever. Which is ironic because I typically like having my characters have bows. Um, but... That's besides the point. Um, this guy, you could talk to him, you could kill him, you could talk to him, then kill him. Um, I'm just gonna kill him, because I don't really feel like going through his whole dialogue. Um, but either way, he drops, um, Estus Flask and Undead Asylum F2 
East Key. No matter what you do, you'll get it from him. Um, but you'll also get another key from him if you kill um, the tutorial boss first. If you kill him first before you go this way. Which you can only do um, if you have... Um, fire bombs, basically. So you can start off with black fire bombs. Um, and from my experience, that's the only way you can kill him early on. Earlier than than intended but if you're able to do that he actually drops a cool weapon you won't be able to use it for a while um, I believe it's 48 strength or something like that but it's called uh, the, the demons great hammer alright so I two handed it so I could do damage and then I did a jump drop attack because again it'll do more damage. Um, I did about three quarters of his health bar with my initial attack. Um, I took minimal damage. I got hit once. Um, but basically his weapon that he wields when um, he's swinging at you is exactly the one that he drops. Except it's a little smaller to scale to the character. Obviously. So the... Uh, miracle I'm going to show you how to get is actually a so it, it's one of the few um, damaging miracles um, aside from so the, it, it's called lightning spear aside from it as a damaging uh, miracle you also have um, wrath of God you have Um, Great Lightning Spear and I believe Sunlight Spear and those are the only damage dealing miracles. I could be wrong. Um, com put in the comments below uh, if you know of other ones that are damage dealing miracles in Dark Souls 1. Or Dark Souls Remastered. Um, but how you get this particular one is first you need 25 faith. Which is why I started off as a cleric. Because it already starts off with 14 faith. Um, but other than that... I'm only unlocking his path to, um, basically by his miracles. I'll be honest. Oh, this guy is a complete dick. I hate him. Um, so there's going to be a quote-unquote story with him and his friends. And essentially... He basically betrays his friends, um, and you'll meet an NPC called Patches, who uh, is in league with that guy. And while they are in the Tomb of the Giants, Patches pushes three of the four of them down because he's in league with the, uh, the fourth one. Um, down a hole, and basically you have to kill two of them 
to save the third. And then later on, he realizes that she survived and tries to kill her. Well, does kill her if you don't kill him first. Um, but other than that, you... She also will go ho hollow if you leave her alone long enough. Um, so be careful of that. So you may have noticed I have put all of my levels into my faith. I'm trying to get to 25 faith as fast as possible. Um, that way I can... So basically, you want to, um, you're going to want to beat the first, uh, boss, the Tauros Demon. Um, because defeating him will actually give you access to this spot where you can get it. Otherwise, you can't. Gonna wanna come up here. Kill these guys. So this guy's this guy throws bombs, but he'll also uh, attack you with a sword. It's like the little snipers with the uh, crossbows. They'll switch to a sword uh, if you get close enough. He's actually called a drake, I think. I think technically he's a drake, not a dragon. He's an asshole to try and fight, too. Fuck him. For swords, honestly. Um, I'm actually also going to want a humanity so I can. So, humanity are good for a couple reasons. So, one, you can actually reverse your hollow, so you can become human. Two, um, it also increases your item discovery. And three, you can kindle your bonfires. 
Though after they're kindled, um, I think most of them you don't have to kindle anymore. Um, once they're 100% kindled. Alright, so I am sitting at 20 faith. So I will be at level 13 by the time I have 25 faith. faster because, you know, for whatever reason, probably because I wasn't doing it right, but it wouldn't do my jump attack. Ugh. I also hate this area because I also get triple teamed. And one of them got bombs. This area is key um, to defeating the Tauros demon. Because you get gold pine resin, and that's uh, suggested when trying to fight the Tauros demon. It is suggested that you use it. Shield fuck. Come here. Thank you. Oh, no. Sorry, bud. I have to retreat for a little bit. So be wary of this guy. Um, I'll show you here in a sec. That's why. I'll throw that after you. Once you uh, get rid of it the first time, you don't have to worry about it again. Um, if you're feeling really ballsy early on, you could uh, do this. At the bottom of this tower is Havel. Also, some people call him Havel the Gravel. May actually be... No, I'm pretty sure he's called Havel the Rock. Um, officially. But either way. So you can fight Havel. If you really want to. Um, that guy, you can fight. He's fairly easy. The hard part is he'll run away. He doesn't actually try and fight you. Oh, um, I want gold pun resin on. That way I can access it easily. So you're going to want to come up here because there's snipers up here. Um, and it's hard to try and fight them as well as 
the boss. And the boss won't trigger until you're about halfway between this tower and the next one. Let's just go balls and ball, balls deep in this shit. Ugh. Some of you more veteran players might be uh, like, oh, you missed some items uh, in some of the previous areas. Yeah, that's because I'm speedrunning this shit. So just walk onto the bridge a little bit and you'll summon the Drake. FYI. Also, he won't attack um, unless you get much closer um, until after you kick down the. Um, we are a mister. The back to summer ending, of course, but I, if you miss. The ladder to unlock a shortcut. I'll show you. Normally, if I were to do this while he's there, he would scorch me. But because I haven't unlocked that shortcut, he's not going to. You're going to want to come over here. Kick that ladder. And then come back up here. Poke your... Okay. Thanks, ass. Poke your little ass out. Scorch them again. In fact, the early game, this is actually a great place to level up. Um, from the dragon's attack, you can actually get 555 souls. Um, and that is all the souls I actually need. Alright, so... Um, make myself as light as I can. Actually, I'll just take that off. I don't care. So take off all the Yeah, that's why we plan. Obviously. Alright. So he breathed a little fire. So you're going to want to wait for him to drop down. Um, he'll do that eventually. So when he gets hit, or when he's trying to find you, he'll drop down like that. Um, so you're gonna want to run across here. That's why we want to be as light as possible. Um, and then this little shrine, um, you're gonna pray at it. You can get the praise the sun gesture, as well as enter the covenant. And when you enter the sunlight covenant, you get the lightning spear, which is great early on. Um, Definitely suggest for faith builds, faith strength builds, anything like that. Um, cool. 
Um, this is also where you get the claymore. Um, but unfortunately, I do not have enough strength for the claymore. Because I focused on, um, other things. And then, here's a shortcut to this. Um, do I have enough? No, I only have one. I could make that. I, I could change that, though. Let's change that. Actually, I don't even know if I needed to do that. Um, I'm actually going to show you what it can do. I didn't even need to do that. Um, so I'm gonna do attunement so I get my second slot. Tune magic, lightning spear. Oh, also I'm gonna want to kindle this. Kindle. I'm gonna quickly show you guys what it could do. Um, because there's a uh, little boar thing called uh, that's immune to, well, immune to physical attacks. Physical attacks just don't do very much. It's like if you were to use physical attack on a shield. I did not mean to do that. I'm not used to having um, multiple miracles anymore. Oh shit! Just die. That's fine. Honestly, this place actually isn't even that bad. Damn it! I keep doing that. Alright. Lightning Spear. So, even though he was blocking, I instant killed him. This guy, he's got tough defenses. So just one lightning spear, that's all you need. And he's dead. Um, he drops something cool. Drops a rare that you can only get from these guys. You can only fight three of them throughout the entire uh, game. I've actually decided that I'm actually going to do a faith strength build just because I can. Oh, I think the other archers are coming up here after I knock them down. Maybe not. Maybe he died. I don't know. More. Whatever. Um. But yeah. So just come back. rest of the bonfire. Let's uh, level up. I can only level up once from that. Uh, this is actually lower level than I normally am for this area. Normally I'm at least level 20, but 
this time for the sake of this I'm level 15 um, but that is how you get the miracle lightning spear um, if you like this sort of content please comment like subscribe and if you want to get notifications that when I post punch that notification bell seriously punch it you'll get notifications unless YouTube decides to be dumb but yeah that's about it see ya